Hi, welcome. I missed you guys. I'm sorry, I'm back. I'm gonna start sharing ideas of things I've been doing here at our family farmhouse down here in Southeast Georgia. So, one thing about a house that makes it cozy is a fireplace. Well, this house happens to not have any walk-in fireplaces, but this room particularly had a mantle with no fireplace. So I used peel and stick tile and I did this faux log insert to make it look like it was a um, stacked wood and it gave it a focal point. So I had to do the same thing in the living room, TV room, media room, so I can hide all the wires and um, basically make another focal point. But I need to do the same thing and the magic the magic material that's going to do this is peel and stick tile. So I'm going to show you how to make a fake faux fireplace look very real and that you will be very proud of. So welcome to the farm. Let's get started. My mother had this 1970 mirror top that went on her dresser and we painted it the dresser but we took the mirror top off because it looked really dated but i decided to save it for something and it just looked like to me when i was looking for something to do for this project like a fireplace so i took out the mirror and then i added these boards for a facade to look like you would see for a fireplace and then i added a top to give me a base for the mantle and then um, where the mirror went, I put a piece of plywood where I painted the inside part black and then I painted the whole thing else white. Then I brought it into the TV living room and I sat it on another piece of plywood that's a little bit wider and a little bit longer than my faux fireplace base. Okay, so this is our living room, TV room. See, I gotta touch up that paint. But I basically made this out of a 70s vanity. So this is just basically a piece of um, wood that I have stationary, and this is sitting on top of it. But I'm just gonna tile this like it's a piece of floor. Okay, so as you can see, I have lined up my full squares in the front and then the um, ones in the back I'm going to cut in half and then we'll shape up on the edge. Okay so you can see that I've got my heart that looks like stone now and some of it's not sticking you can add more adhesive but mine looks pretty good. So I spray painted these wooden corbels I had and just added them there just to see what they would look like and then I felt like after looking in the room, I felt like I needed to make it look like it's rustic. So I wanted more like a solid wood, real fat beam. So I decided to go up to the hill. There is like an old um, wood house that there's some wood laying around inside there. They're very old. And I found some pieces to make a faux mantle piece that's real thick like a slab or a big old beam and I basically screwed them to the top. I didn't have the right tools to cut perfect you know angles but I screwed the boards together on the top of my base there and then I made it look like a box by boxing it around on the the face side as you're looking onto it and even adding a box underneath it so it all looks like a solid piece and that's it and then I was able to put the light a little light even if you're watching TV and you want a little light you can turn that on to light up the logs that I put in and that's it Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.